think... I think I lost him. Just I'd say. Check this out. <laughs> and mom said this stuff. <laughs> I can't believe you still twirl. Mm. Yeah, it helps me think. I can't believe you moved to Ireland. And you're going to spend the rest of your life mm. here. I don't know about the rest of my life, but this is where the new job is. Well, I'm going to miss the crap out of you. I'm going to miss you too. So glad Ryan organized this reunion trip. What's this? That. Ryan made that for me. Shop class senior year. I think I made him one too. So stupid. You kept it. Me and Ryan broke up four years ago. Just friends now. Does Ryan know that? You gonna give me a hard time this whole trip? No, I'll save that for your dorky brother. Knock, knock. Uh, here he is. Uh, I'm looking for my sister. Oh, yeah. How you doing? So glad you could make it. Well, I wouldn't miss this. Hey, Anita. When did you get hot? <laughs> uh, you also one of the guys going here. You know, I'm happy to spring for a vehicle that doesn't run on steam. Look, I'm psyched you got a sweet job offer out the gate, but I think it'd be weird if you paid for everyone. Yo, wouldn't be weird for me. Well, yeah, of course. Yeah. Dude, you shouldn't have had that curry last night. Aw, oh, shock. Honestly, dude, I think I just followed through. <laughs> Look, Tommy, it's not so bad, okay? They shipped this bad boy over from Germany just for us. You know, it's, it's got it's got a cassette player, <laughs> a little AC going on. It could be worse, man. That's what I'm saying. So, uh, where are we going on this trip anyway? Chuck, do you read your emails? No. <laughs> well, we're going everywhere. We're seeing it all, man. Yeah, we're going to spend a couple of days looking at castles, some ruins. If that doesn't float your boat, we're going to go see the Guinness Brewery. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Ah. Yo, you know, I'm totally down with this, like, reunion, Woo! on wheels, yeah. in Europe, but are you sure this isn't some final play to see if there's still a spark with you and a certain K? I knew you'd ask that. We're just friends. So, that whole grace period is officially over. For what? You want me to hit that? Booyah! Oh, oh yeah! I did not just say that. Why not? I mean, it's not like you have any feelings for her anymore or anything, right? Right? I knew it! He still digs her, dude! Ryan loves Kate. Ryan loves Kate. Oh, yeah. Like 30 
36 million. You press the button once, that's it. Hey, hey what's up, man? Uh, not much, bro. Hi, baby. Long time. How you been? Good. When you get so big? Good to see you, man. Or should I say Doc? Yeah, well, I guess all those years pretending my calculator was a tricorder finally paid off, right? I don't know what that is. Hey, Joel, think fast. Hey, Chuck. Here, give me that. Come on. Awesome. That still hurt. Uh, ah, it's been better. Hey, boy. Hey. hey. <laughs> How are we? Hey. Hi. Ryan! Hey. hey! I've missed you. How you doing? Good. Hey, guys. Hey. 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 Yo. Nice bags. And why is he coming with us again? His dad tipped him for gas. I don't think it was worth it. Okay, so, who's ready to see Ireland? Yeah, let's do this. Yeah, so how was the flight, okay? Yeah, it was yeah. good. Contaminated the bathroom. Hey, don't blame me, blame the curry. Oh, this place is creepy. I am not using the bathroom here. You're such a girl. You doing alright? Ah! Hey, hands off the merchandise. Hello? Well, this place was in the travel brochure. Hey, guys, look. I'm exhausted. Nice. Oh. <laughs> hey. Hey. How are you? Yeah. Rick a brat. Dude, look at all this crap. Chuck, they can hear you, man. face here. Sorry we never got a chance to talk before. Me and Derek breaking up and graduation. Yeah, look, don't sweat it. But I'm really glad you put this trip together. Yeah, well, you say that now. <laughs> You know, I'm gonna... Oh, 
I was reading the uh, Chicago Tribune online, and I saw an ad there. Is a coaching job just opening up at Arden High? Mm -hmm. Why? Well, I, I just thought. Yeah, you know, I uh, think I'm gonna go work for my dad. Really? Okay. It's just a, a lot of great players coach. Yeah, I just never got the chance to be great, you know? So, I'm gonna go look for someone. Look. What? Souvenir from the trip. He's kind of gay, dude. This from a guy who did ballet till he was 16? He's got you there. You know how many chicks do ballet? <clears throat> how much is this? Yo! <sighs> Ten euros for you, brother. Okay. Thank you, brother. Have a nice day. Circus must be in town. <laughs> Anybody here? How much is that? I'm so sorry. That's not for sale. Come on. Everything's for sale. Are you for sale? <laughs> no, dude. I'm afraid not quite everything's for sale, darling. 50 euros. Don't fall for it. It's a trick. He just wants to raise the price. Did you not hear what I said? I said it's not for sale. 100. 100. Anita, this would look awesome with this new dress I'm designing. Very well. 100 euros, sold to the girl with the brown eyes. That didn't hurt so much, did it? Didn't hurt at all. I'll box it up for you. I'll tell your future for 20 euros. No, thank you. Ryan. Ryan. That's the name of your one true love. Will I get back together with him? You spent so much money on that thing. Yo, I think it looks awesome. Wait, this isn't what I bought. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> he pulled a bait and switch on you. <laughs> I see his face.
go, dude. What the hell? Did anyone hear some sort of a whining noise? <laughs> dude. Dude? Oh, hello. Can I help you? Yeah. You can give us what we paid for. I, I gave her a much nicer piece, or ten times as much. Matches her eyes. <laughs> so? Goodbye now. Look, dude. I said goodbye now. I really want to go now. Come on, guys. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Way to go. <laughs> yeah, you really showed them. You can't have that. Get that back to me now, like a good boy, huh? Do you hear what I said? You don't know what you're dealing with here. <laughs> What's keeping you? Do you want me to send you a telegram? Can you help her? I don't know. Yo. Is she dead? Chuck, you're such an idiot! Well, it's not my fault she stepped in front of the van. This is so not good. Yeah, so what are we gonna do? We gotta figure something out. What's to figure out? Let's go! Guys! I think she might be dead. <gasps> I warned you! I warned you! This zombie rock will take vengeance upon you all! You've got to go! Come on. Get them! Come on! Stop them! Get them in! Come on! she grabbed Kate, I think she'll be fine. I can't believe we just left her like that. We didn't have a choice. What did she say to you guys? Look, guys, talking about it isn't gonna help. She said something called Simbolok was gonna seek vengeance on us. No, she said Simura. That's what I said. Wait, you know what she's talking about? Well, yeah, but... <laughs> Look, a Simurak is a giant mythical bird of prey. All right, it's from the adventures of Simbad. It's just a legend. She said it was gonna come after us one by one. It was a curse. There's no such thing as curses. I've never seen fog move like this before. Me either. I told you. It's fog, Haley. It's not a curse. Ryan, do you wanna turn back? I'm gonna keep going. Who's that? I don't know. It sounded pretty big. Probably just a branch. Yo. That sounded like a bird. <laughs> don't look at me. Simi rocks aren't real. Well, whatever's up there, it's pretty damn real. Come on. Come on. What's wrong? We should have hit the next town by now. Oh, dude, don't even say we're lost. We're lost? We're not lost. We just don't know where we are. Yo, Tommy, toss me the map. Chuck, what's out there? 
I don't know, dude. I can't see a damn thing. The gas station was off the N8 junction, right? Yeah. Well, then we should have at least hit the campground by now. Maybe we passed it in the fog. Maybe. Great. Just great. Look, the fog seems to be clearing. Where are we? I don't know. Joel? Honestly, I have no idea. But according to this, we should have at least hit the next town by now. Guys, there is something above us. Would you shut up, Chuck? Dude, seriously. Chuck, honestly, this is no time for one of your comedy routines, okay? Dude, I saw a shadow. Are you serious? Maybe that's all it was, Chuck, a shadow. It was a big shadow and it flew right above us. Flying? This is all your fault. My fault? Guys. Yeah, all this gypsy curse talk, it's got everyone's imaginations running wild. Guys. Well, you would blame me, wouldn't you? Guys! What? Okay, I don't know what is more creepy. Imagining some gypsy death hawk or freaky feral kid out there. I know, right? But we still don't know where we are, so someone still needs to go ask him. Seriously? You guys are afraid to go out there? <sighs> Whatever. No, Anita, don't. <laughs> hey! What's he laughing at? Why do you run away? Two. Now, fossils of birds like that in New Zealand, but it, like it... Y'all, are we anywhere near New Zealand right now? I told you we were cursed. Ah! <sighs> oh. My God, we're all gonna freaking die! Chuck! What? Look, the old lady said that that thing was gonna come after us one by one. Now look what it's just done to Anita. Look, everyone just chill. Chill? I've just seen Anita get killed by a giant bird, and you just want me to chill. Yeah, look, listen, as long as we're in here and it's out there, we're fine. You really think we're safe in here? Did you not see what that thing is capable of? Ryan's right. Everybody calm down. What, what about the, the button? What? The, the emergency call button. Th there, that thing. Yeah, but it's just a glorified cell phone with one number. No, dude, it's a satellite phone, all right? And they can trace the signal anywhere. What are we waiting for? Press the button! Hey, what language is that? It's German. Well, the RV's from Germany. Well, does anyone speak German? There's no one there. It's a recorded message. The subscription must have lapsed. But well, guys, what are we gonna do? Yeah, wh what are we gonna do? The only thing we can do, we keep driving until we find some kind of town or city. And then what? Then it's not just our problem anymore. <gasps> Great. You got a better idea? Dude, we're stuck in a foreign country with a giant bird chasing after us. Well, until we figure something else out, I say we just keep driving. Ryan! <laughs> Dude, 
do? Come on. Ryan, why have we stopped? You blew a tire. I don't see it anymore. Me either. Maybe it thinks we're dead. Uh, not likely. Look, we need to get the hell out of here before it comes back for more. Kate, if we keep going, we'll damage the rim and then we're not going anywhere. So what are we gonna do? We gotta change a tire. What? You got any better ideas? Okay. Who's gonna be the one to go out there? I'm sorry to put this out there, but I've never changed a tire before in my life. Right. Me neither. I don't even know how to drive. Okay, I'll do it. No. I'll go. No, I'm going to. Rock, paper, scissors. Okay. Stop doing scissors. You stop doing scissors. Where's the jack? Take this. We can stay in touch that way. And this. Flare? It's the best we got. Which tire? I think it's the back left. Had to be the one farthest from the door. Sure you don't want me to come? Tick tock, dude. Be careful. Dude! What is wrong with you? What? Dude? Tommy. Just checking. I can't believe this is happening. I can't believe she's gone. I know. <laughs> I should have done something. Well, there was nothing anyone could have done. How do you know? Nearly there. Over. Tragedy's been known to bring two people closer together. You're not actually hitting on me, are you? Hey, this could be your last day on Earth. <sighs> Tommy! Dude, you scared the crap out of me. Yeah, I meant to. Hurry up, I think it's coming back. I don't see anything. Yeah, just hurry up. I'm hurrying, I'm hurrying. You need to get in here now. Almost done. I mean now. Just one more bolt. I don't see it anymore. Dude, I'm scared. How you doing, Tommy? Yo, what was 
What's that? Yo, run! Yo, run! Yo, run! Tommy! Tommy! Yo, this doesn't feel right. This feels like a damn trap. Tommy! Should let me try and see. It's not your fault. He was dead already, bro. Did you see his face? We at least could have tried. What do you want me to say? Look, we've been cursed by a damn gypsy. A freaking killer bird is after us. I've just watched my high school crush get decapitated, so maybe I freaking panicked. It doesn't matter anyway, dude. Look, Tommy was already dead. You don't know that! No, screw you! You should be thanking me for saving your life. Dude, get no, off! Guys, stop, stop, stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Get off stop me! It. Stop me. Get off stop me. me! Stop it! Get off! Now. Yo, Kate's right. Look, if we want to survive this, we have to stick together. Now, come on. Yo, maybe they got a phone, we can call some help. Hey, look, it's flying away. I'm sorry, we didn't mean to burst in like that. It's okay, you in trouble? No, uh, can we use your phone, please? We can. Thank you. Thank you. Come in. Look at the state of you. Hi. Are you all right? Um, do you have a more private line? No, love. That's the only phone. Okay. Can I get you anything else? No, we're fine. I'm just the phone. Yes. Dead on the road. It was him. He did it. What? You. You killed our Nadia. Wait, the old lady, she's dead. No way. She was totally alive when we left. You killed Nadia. Left her to die. No, wait. We can explain. Please, it, it was an accident. It never would have happened if he didn't rip us off. Oh, it's my fault, is it? I put manners on you, you little pussy. Where is it? What? 
the medallion. Where is it? The little one with the brown eyes, she had it. Where is she? She's dead. Two of our friends are dead. Okay, so let's just call it even and we'll just go. You think it's even, do you? Look, no. It's not, you're right. Look, we messed up and we're sorry. Sorry. But you need to call the police. Right. You should totally call the cops. We have our own way of doing things. We straighten me out. Come on. Wait, please. She cursed us. Haley. What? Even if they do call the police or we get out of here, that thing is still going to get us. What thing? Simi Rock. Rock. Give you what you deserve. Wait, please. It was an accident. We'll do anything. Please just undo the curse. Only the one who cursed you can take it back, love. But that means... That means your bird feet. Now get out. <laughs> Bird feet, dude. Out. Where are you taking us? Out the woods. Show you a bit of the local scenery. Hey. Hey, what if we told you where the medallion was? The medallion. You know where the medallion is? Yes. Why didn't you say so before? That puts a new complexion on everything. Well, if we give it to you, you're gonna let us go? <laughs> of course I will. It's in a safe in the RV. Is it? If you take us there, we'll open it for you. John, you know I'm starting to like this one. She's definitely growing on me. I think it might be love. <laughs> what are you doing? We can get to the army, then we can escape. Fair enough. Drina will take you to get the medallion. No way. Ah! Hey, no, wait! What about us? You're coming with me. Nature checking, remember? Hey, we had a deal! We have a deal. She gets the medallion, brings it back to me, and then I let you go. A deal is a deal. Take me instead. You, do you see this? This is a gun pointing at your head. So shut your gob and move your ass, as they say in America. Young people nowadays, they just won't do what they're told. <laughs> Boys and girls, welcome to the bird feeder. Oh, crap. <laughs> hey, whoops a daisy. Mind yourself, love. You're not wearing the right sort of footwear for this sort of terrain, you know? Come on, come on. We've got to get out of here. You guys are crazy. Hey. It doesn't have to go down like this. Look, I'm sure we can work something out. I'm afraid this is where your journey ends. Yeah, but we had a deal, right? But the good news is... Your curse will be over soon. Wait, I, I thought you said that it couldn't be lifted. Yeah. I think he means they're gonna end it for us. Hey! We had a deal! I lied. <laughs> uh, Bleeding time. <laughs> Let's get out of here. 
out of here. It's gonna get messy. Dude, you can't just leave us here! I'd love to stay. It's just... I can't stand the sight of blood. It gives me a queasy tummy. Why do you want it so bad? Oh, that's none of your business, is it? <laughs> and how do I know you're gonna keep your end of the deal? Oh, you can trust me. And what if I don't? What just happened? off one by one. Because just like the hell he said, it is a curse. Damn it. Keep it down, will you? You're like an elephant in a china shop. Yoo-hoo! Come out, come out, wherever you are! Shaking in your boots. I hope you're saying your prayers. You hear me now? You hear me now, dude? Because when I get you, I'm going to wring your little necks. Oh, 
back for me. We gotta keep moving. We gotta find Kate and Joel. Ryan. Yeah. You've been shot. What? Oh. Oh. Let me get this off. Yeah. Come on. Chuck, come on! I didn't even feel it. Yo, you gotta plug that thing up or else you might as well leave a trail of breadcrumbs for those freaks. You just gave me an idea. Hold this. ourselves first. Damn it! Everything looks the same. Oh, the field was back that way. You're sure? Yeah. What, what are we waiting for? Come on, let's no, go. No, we're not going without them. All right. Well, we can get the RV and come barreling back through here and pick them up. Jack's got the keys. Oh, yeah. We're all right. We'll go find Ryan and Chuck, okay? Come on. Until that adrenaline wears off. Look, I can't do anything from here, guys. We gotta get you back to the RV. Okay. Come on, let's go. Come on. Come on. Just leave me alone. Because you got something that's mine. This. You really want this. Why? Why is it so important to you? You'll find out soon enough. Just give it to me. All right. Okay. You want this? It's yours.
<laughs> okay. Uh, there's no book. Book? Uh, you know, inst in instructions. Instructions? You've done this before, right? Yeah. Lots of times. On, uh... On dummies. Dummies? They were very realistic dummies. Dude, you don't have a choice, all right? You've got to let me do this. Okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh. And again, bro. This isn't gonna be nice. It's not a bad idea. Are you sure you should be doing that? Yeah! Oh. Sorry. Oh, that looks really bad. Ready? Yeah. Okay. <sighs> oh. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm pretty sure. I mean, this is a major surgery. Just a flesh wound. Just need to stop the bleeding so we can get you to a to a hospital. If we get to a hospital, you just keep driving. Yo, what the hell happened back there, Kate? I think the medallion might have protective powers against the rock. Well, yeah, like, uh, um, a talisman. No wonder they wanted it back. <sighs> Tell me more about the rock. Uh, uh, apart from the fact that it's, uh, really smart, really strong, really fast. <laughs> you can't beat it. Yeah, well, if we all want to survive, we got to figure a way to outsmart it. Okay. I should hold. We done. We done? Good job. Okay, I'm gonna get some towels. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, I'm sweating. He's on the bed. Thanks. <laughs> Stupid. You probably don't remember making this. No. He'll stop! Why did we stop? Look, we just passed the rest stop. So? So they probably have a payphone. What do you want me to do? Pull up close so that you can reach out or play arm or no arm? What if we use a medallion? One of us could go out there with it on. Yeah, but that's if this new theory is correct. I think we should keep it as a backup plan. Why can't we just stick to the original plan? We've, we've got to be near a real town by now. We could be even farther away. All right, look, we don't know where we are. Okay, this could be our only shot. You know what? Joel's right. We haven't passed anywhere in ages. So what's the plan? Well, Rock's been following the RV, right? So? Well, the way I see it, this thing can't be in two places at once. If I duck out into the woods, try and find something, hopefully he'll follow you. Right. No. And what if it doesn't, Ryan? What is this, your last chance to be the hero or no. something? This isn't about playing the hero, Kate. This is about survival. And then what? You just circle back around after you call the cops and you just jump back on board? I guess. Quiet. I just found the same. Go! Oh. 
Yo, is it following us? No, I can't see it. Well, me either. I think it went after Ryan. Maybe we should turn back. <laughs> Kidding me. Hot oh, damn it, it's turning around. What is going after Ryan? Crap. Emergency, we serve. Finally! Look, I don't know where I am. But you gotta chase this call. There's something trying to kill me. Where are you located? I just told you, I don't know where I am. The system is showing you're outside the county lines. I need to transfer you to another section. No, wait, you don't understand! <laughs> Fire. What? The rock was created by fire. Only fire can harm it. Ryan. He made the call first. I'm sure he's fine. Inside, come on! Yeah, but it's definitely still out there. Yo, I don't, I don't understand. How, how did that pain get Ryan with the medallion on him? Didn't get him. Well, what about the blood? Look, the gypsy shot him. All right? If you're wearing the medallion, then that thing can't touch you. You took the medallion? Kate, okay, what? Put it in my pocket. Right, now, wh why would Ryan do that? Because he wanted me to be safe. I'm sorry. 
I'm sorry, Jack. cheated on him. What? I was confused. That's why you broke up with him? <sighs> he always thought it was because he got so depressed about his injury. cheated on my MCATs. What? You're one of the smartest guys I know. Yeah, I know, right? It's not an easy label to wear. I just didn't want to let anyone down. that it matters now. My cousin touched me. What? Nothing. Uh, was your cousin a guy or a girl? Dude. Think I'd have a problem if it was a girl? Yo, I think I hear something. He must have flown away. Just one car? Dude, we're in the middle of Ireland. It's probably their entire force. Look, maybe he's just here to bring us back into town. Or maybe they didn't get Ryan's call. Hey, have some faith. Are we glad to see you? You kids all right? No. Officer, you gotta listen to us. I'm all ears. Okay, well, did Ryan Barrow contact you? I don't believe so. Tell him. Okay, well, this is gonna sound crazy, but there's this thing that's been chasing us. A killer bird. Really big, really strong. Yeah. Right. That eviscerates people before flying off their bodies. Exactly. Yeah. I know all about the rock. Oh, thank you. You killed my brother, Liam. I'm so sorry. Yo! I'm just here for the trinket. <laughs> the thing around your neck. I don't believe this. He's with the gypsies. Taking the medallion to save yourself. Save my family. My curse has it coming after my loved ones. <clears throat> the rock took my brother Liam and my father. I can't afford to let it go after my wife and children as well. Yeah, well, you have what you want now. Why don't you just let us go? Because I'm like your curse. My curse can be lifted. I was just up at the old gypsy place you visited earlier. And the gypsy I apparently wronged gave me a shot at redemption. He said he'd lift my curse. 
If I help the rock, get you. Without this, now it can. <laughs> <laughs> nice moves. Thanks. <laughs> Shouldn't have done that. <laughs> if I didn't have to let the rock catch you, you'd all be dead by now. Now give me that. He said he couldn't shoot us. No, he said he couldn't kill us. Doesn't mean he can't shoot us. <sighs> oh, yeah. You can't stop it. It'll get you one way or another. Dude. What? Come on, let's go. Wait. There's got to be a radio in the car. Hello? Hello? Hello, can anyone hear me? the medallion. Anything you ever wish you did? Like a bucket list. Well, when you say it like that, it kind of sounds like a bad thing. 
No, like, I mean, never want to skydive or see the pyramids or anything like that. No. What about, like, go to the moon? No. Come on, there's gotta be, like, something you wanna do. I wanna invent a freaking time machine. There you go. You know why? Why? Because I want Ryan back. I want my Ryan back. I want my brother back. What do you want, Chuck? I want to be a dad one day. I'm not too smart. I'm pretty good at sports, but I'm not great. I think I'd make a great dad. Yeah, I might not be good at the homework helping part, but I can teach him for my bonehead moves and help him to grow up right. I think you'd make a great dad. I'd also love a three-way. You are such an idiot, you know that. Yeah. Signal. What's he saying? Babe, okay, just, just, if you can hear me, just tell us where you are, we'll come get you. Kate, okay, what's he saying? Oh, I lost signal. Damn it! Kate! Okay. Kate, okay, are you insane? No, I'm trying to get bars. Kate, okay, get back in here. Kate, okay, come on. I got it. Kate, okay, look, seriously, get back in the... Glad you could make it. It's not your phone. That's not your phone. That's Ryan's. Where did you get that phone? He asked me to call you. Where is he? He's over there. In the rock's nest. He said he really wanted you to be here. You're a little late. What the hell is wrong with you people? It was an accident. An accident, maybe. But it's one you're gonna pay for. Get the hell out of here. Did your mommy never tell you don't play with guns? Back off. Safety first. We don't want any more accidents today now, do we? Back. Off. Fair enough. I'm... back in half. I, uh, don't suppose there's any point in asking you about my battalion. No, 
Accident. I'm in a spot of trouble at the moment, and, um, well, I, I, I can't really explain. Not that you would understand anyway, but, um, I just want to say, uh, it's something you can't bail me out of, so.
tell, tell mom I love her. And, um, <laughs> tell Johnny he's a butthead. There's a million things I just want to say. I, I can't remember any of them, so, um... I just want to say thanks, Pop. And, um... Yeah. Corey touched me in fifth grade. Have my medallion back now, please. Yo, dude, I just want to go home. That's it. Good boy. Hold back to me now. Time to die. 